Good morning, friends. I hope you all had a wonderful 4th of July. I have just a small Dollar Tree haul to share with you. I found a few good books and just some random odds and ends. So I thought I'd come on here and do a haul. The first thing I have to show you is this deluxe three pack of nail polish. And it has a suggested retail up in the corner of $14.99. So I thought that was a good deal for $1.25, a three pack of nail polishes. So I'm probably going to paint my fingernails and toenails today. They surely need it. Then I found this luminance. This is a travel battery powered toothbrush. I excited to find this. I hope it works well. They had a couple of different designs. This is the one that I chose. And also in the oral health care, I found the oral care kits. It has the metal pick, the mirror, the tongue scraper, and the toothbrush. Really good for $1.25. And I always find the almond milk at Dollar Tree, but it's never the unsweetened. So I found this, the almond, it's the Modern Pantry Almond Plant Based Beverage Unsweetened, high in calcium, gluten-free, 30 calories per serving. I like the unsweetened for my smoothies and things like that. These are a repurchase, the Stacy's Pita Thins, Garlic and Herbs. These are so delicious, especially if you dip them in hummus and they're a little bit healthier than chips I'm trying to eat healthier and then I show these these are actually my husband's he loves everything Reese's so do I and these are a repurchase for him he bought a couple of these for our vacation that we just went on so those are very good then Dollar Tree just keeps getting in more new crackers so this these are the thin vegetables which is kind of like the um Thin Wheats, thin, Wheat Thins brand, not Thin Wheats, Wheat Thins brand. This is a 7 ounce box in the Garden Veggie flavor. And I also found the Snack Time Snack Pack, Stack Pack, the global brands. And this is in the Vegetable Crackers. This is like a dupe for the Vegetable Ritz, which are super good and I love those. So I always see the Snack Time Stack Pack Crackers in the red box, which are like a dupe for the regular Ritz. So I was excited to find these. It says it's a bonus pack with 20% more. It is a 12-ounce box. Definitely good for $1.25. Now for the books. For Letter or Worse, a Stationery Shop Murder Mystery Book by Vivian Conroy. My 16-year-old daughter loves cozy mysteries, and so do I. So I actually got this for her. She will probably read it, and then I will probably read it afterwards. It's always great to find books at Dollar Tree for $1.25. You can't beat it. That was a paperback. This one is a hardback. The cover is so stunningly beautiful on this one. It's Bethlehem, a novel by Karen Kelly. Mystery, first love, and long-held secrets fold together in the atmospheric tale. So the regular retail looks like it's $26.99. That's crazy. So expensive. And here is advanced praise for Bethlehem on the back. I am currently reading the authenticity project that I got from Dollar Tree. And it's wonderful. Like their books can be hit or miss. But I find a lot that are really, really good. So this is a Jennifer Steele novel, Exile Music. It is another hardback. It's a pretty big book. Might be hard to see. And the recommended retail on this one is $27. Here's what the back of the book looks like. There's more advanced praise for Exile Music. So they look like pretty good ones. The last thing I have to show you is a hardback book called Feed Me Words. This is 40 bite-sized stories, quizzes, and puzzles to make spelling and word use fun. So I do homeschool four of my children, 
and I thought this would be good for the younger ones. This is what the back of it looks like. And then I'll show you the inside. So very good a learning book. And the thing with stuff like this, if you don't tell your kids that it's for learning, if they think it's just for fun, they're more likely to engage in it. Remember, learning doesn't just take place between like certain hours of the day or at an actual school. Learning takes place anytime. So always try to make learning fun, whether your kids are homeschooled or public schooled. That is everything I have today, everyone. I hope that you all have a wonderful rest of your week. I hope to see you maybe Monday. Bye.